Remember my teacher asked me, Brian, what's the I before E rule? Um, I before E, always. What are you, an idiot, Brian? Well, apparently. So she explains it, no, Brian, it's I before E, except after C, and when sounding like A is a neighboring way, and on weekends and holidays and all throughout May, and you'll always be wrong no matter what you say. That's a hard rule. That's a, that's a rough rule. Plurals were hard, too. Brian, how do you make a word a plural? Oh, you, you put an S. You, you put an S at the end of it. When? <sighs> On weekends and holidays. And... No, Brian. No, let me show you. So she asked this kid who knew everything, Irwin. Irwin! Erwin, what is he plural for ox? Oxen. The farmer used his oxen. Brian, what? <laughs> Brian, what's the plural for box? Boxen. <laughs> I bought two boxen of donuts. <laughs> oh, no, Brian, no. Let's try another one. Erwin, what is he plural for goose? Geese. I saw a flock. Of geese. Brian, what? Brian, what's the plural for moose? Moosen! I saw a flock of moosen. There are many of them, many much moosen. Out in the woods, in the wood is, in the woods in. The meat's wanting the food. Food is to eating, is it? The meat's wanting the food and in the wooding in, is it? In the food in the wood in, is it? Brian, Brian. You're an imbecile. Imbecile. What are you speaking, German, Brian? German. Germain. Germain. Jackson. Jackson 5. Tito. Brian, what the hell are you talking about? Oh, no. The results came back, but there's no easy way of saying this, so I'm just going to cut to the chase. You have lung cancer, and unfortunately, it has metastasized meaning that the tumor cells have spread to other parts of your body. How long do I have? Hard to say. But people at your stage rarely last even two Did weeks. somebody say cancer? Small weed every day. The Weed the Make-A-Wish Foundation like to make your dreams come true only if you're dying. And just last week we helped a crippled kid by getting him Just Dance 3. Oh, the tears of joy are so sweet! Or so I'm told. So, spy! Are you ready to make your wish? Hell yeah. Well, what is it that you want? A bath with a rubber duck or a beardless rabbi? A massive cock or a black guy with a tie? Just come on, pick something. You don't have all day. <laughs> Literally. I want the pie. We don't have pies. I wish I could fly. It's Tim and Kim and Jim. Here's a story that is rather grim. What's to do for a party of three? What's that, Tim? It's to climb a tree. Firstly, find a tree that's up to play ball. That's too tall. That's too small. Put your leg on a branch. But be careful you don't hear a crunch. Because if hips and butts were candies and nuts, you're going to fall up and break your legs. Now, now, Kim, what did I say? Climbing a tree's far from child's play. This isn't a joke! You can clearly see the bone! That's probably not your funny bone, cuz... This shit ain't funny. Our mothers warned us about this, didn't they? Tim? They said, no climbing trees today, kids. Someone might get hurt. What did we do? We didn't listen. We are the ones to blame. What are you talking about? We have to help him! You're not thinking of the consequences. What would our fathers do if one of us came back with a broken leg? We could end up with one of our own, Jim.
What are you suggesting then? Oh no. Have you ever put a dog down, Jim? A three-legged puppy is not a happy puppy. D dude, I, I think I'm fine. The, the bone's healing. <laughs> I can, I can probably stand up. Jim, tonight we bond like lovers through their firstborn.